So it might have been a little while, but we're back into numero uno now. I've got a good feeling about this episode. We've hit 350,000 people up till now, but uh, because we're pumping out those high density buildings, we really might hit a new milestone, although that's rather questionable because there's no demand for any residential buildings at the moment, but you never know. Things change, especially when we play on cheetah mode. What is it? Cheetah, it's rhino and turtle. Oh, supposedly the Java rhinos, I think they're called in Indonesia, they've been completely wiped out, which is quite sad. They were, they were actually some pretty special rhinos. They looked really cool, but I guess they are no more. I think, or maybe there was only like a really, really, because I remember there used to be nine or so a couple years back. But anyway, why am I talking about some rhinos that uh, I can have a fond memory of, but have no idea why I can even remember that. But let's get right back into things. Uh, sort of forgotten what's been happening over here. We've got the two airports, of course, and we are facing the western side. Well, we're playing mostly on the western side. Um, we still have like the northern side as well as the eastern side ready for development. So you never know, but I do need a lot more office space and just commercial services. I'm pretty sure we've got that over here, at least something like offices or something. It's medium density, so there'll be offices. What are people complaining about here? Ben due to commute time. Can't be that bad though, can it? Let's play in super fast mode. On cheetah mode, that is. And just check out what things are happening seeing if anything is growing if we need to improve some things yes i guess the customers are going to be low in this section i could extend this section with people though that's what i'll do and in fact well, there we go we've got a couple of residential houses coming up which is weird because there doesn't seem to be demand for it but what if i do this wait oh there's a train line over here okay that's fire protection. I don't really care about fire protection. I only really care about it once it starts biting us in the backside. I'll probably build a bit more housing up over here. I'll have to like improve the uh, livable livability of this area. I might have to diesel. Oh, that looks sort of weird and nice. Looks probably it looks okay, but it's not probably the most functional of uh, roads with all these roundabouts everywhere. Yeah, I don't think it rendered out probably whatever it was trying to do. Um, hmm. What should I do? I want to keep that. It'd be a nice little feature of this map. And I'll probably... Uh, see? We'll have to, like, build uh, high schools and hospitals around this area as well. Clinics. I'm not really too keen on that. Check out power. Okay, we're still doing good for power. Water. Ooh, something that I'll have to keep an eye out on. Air pollution. Jobs and population. Okay, so that's low density no no that's is that no that's low income sorry that is low income we've got a lot of low income people now don't we have definitely racked up because we lowered the tax just a little bit so that's 8.5 percent just so we can suck a, a couple more people in for all they're worth just want to figure out what's wrong up with that like this area it's over here Commute is short, school grade is high, so that's good. Uh, but maybe we might have hit like a cap in terms of parks, etc. Or maybe it's just that I need to place a couple of them. So let's go ahead and just place some um, random things here and there. Especially need. Ooh, that's probably not the best placement, is it? Let's place it there. Because they've got to be facing the arrow, like the blocks of land. What else? A medium flower garden can never go wrong. So we put two up here. Okay, there we go. That's working. At least a little bit. People want to live next to their all the roundabouts. As you do. What else can we do? Oh, we're having traffic problems. Alright. So, with let's build a large garden thingamajig. These people will have cars. Well, they'll be able to drive. At least, hopefully, they will be able to. Because it usually glitches up like that. But, what we'll have to do is to start getting rid of the traffic problems is building toll booths you want water okay there's only a couple of guys that don't have water maybe we've hit the uh maximum amount. yeah okay it's definitely getting close to the maximum amount so let's go ahead and fix that up by building a large water pump which definitely never goes wrong 
place it right up on there and I'll also go underneath and I'll place a couple of these pipes or extend a couple of them. There we go. Can't go wrong. Now let's go back up. I'm looking forward to after this episode as well because I'm looking forward to watching uh, Zero Dark Thirty, I think it's called, about uh, how the US captured Osama bin Laden or something of the sorts, like the lead up to it at least, and torture, which supposedly it's not the most uh, realistic recreation. I think that's what the movie directors are trying to push it as, as something that's realistic and something like based on a true story, but. It's not. I think even a couple of US senators spoke out against it. I look forward to watching it. I'm not really a massive fan of movies at all, really. I get most of my entertainment from playing games. Um, so, we've got the, we've fixed the water problem, or at least, yep, we have indeed. So let's check out commute time. Okay, it's going up continuously, although I think it's down from water. Oh no, it's really high. Okay, forget I said anything. So what I'll have to do is, let's go to the data view, and go look at the traffic. Okay, it's not too bad anywhere really, it's just this section, that section's always been bad. There's just a couple of these little bits here and there, especially with the, all these high density buildings I guess. But why is it so bad over here? Oh, is it not connected properly? That would probably be why. All right. Let's fix that up. I've also been... Oh, no, we don't that. I've also been playing a bit of Devil May Cry. Uh, that's been definitely uh, some great fun playing that. Before it's come out, I look forward to possibly doing a Let's Play of it. If you guys seem interested in it. I wouldn't be surprised if you are. What's that thing? I have no idea. All right, that's a bit of rail. Uh-huh. Oh, okay. Wait, 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 wait. I don't like what's happening. Let's get rid of this. What do you want? Neighbor power sales threatens. Ooh. Numero Uno is experiencing a power shortage. A power shortage? Jeez, these problems keep on coming along. What's this power shortage you speak of? Oh, wow. Okay. They're going up and down, up and down. It's not that bad. I'll wait up a little bit still. But yes, we need to fix up this rail. There we go. That should work out. Not really sure what the problem was before, but okay. And now back to the toll booths. So toll booths should be in where we build roads, I'd assume. Sounds like someone stole someone others, someone else's car. A couple of these other vehicles, oh not vehicles, but houses are having problems as well. In mid time, can't be that bad. Although it has d drastically gotten worse as well. So, it's not even highways, is it? No. It'd be here, wouldn't it? This is what I assume it. Public park. Oh, there we go. Toll booth generates some revenue but causes traffic delays. That's the problem. It causes traffic de delays. I don't care about revenue, really. I mean, we have no problem making money. It's just getting rid of all the problems for the people. Um, so maybe a parking garage would help. Improves effectiveness of adjacent traffic stops in residential areas. There we go. So like, this area here is quite bad. So I'll improve that area. As well as, zoom out. Oh, it looks so nice with all these nice houses. Alright. Zoom in right in over here, and hopefully this will be close enough. Or good enough, at least. Um, is there any better way I can place this? Doesn't seem like it. I have to do do that. All right. You know what? Let's get rid of that and place another one. Sorry. Gonna have to do it all over again. Go to public parking garage and place it there. Yeah. Should have done that before. Hopefully that'll get rid of a bit of the problems. I also should probably connect up some of these little... Well, instead of streets, I'll connect roads up. 
because it's that's a smart thing to be doing. Um, no, I don't want any ramps. I want cancel that. Just come underneath and then cross over. There we go. Yeah, this should also be extended just so if anyone wants to I don't know, go around the long way, not on the highway. These black highways are so much more efficient and better. But the only thing is you can't join up roads. Bit of a problem. And I was looking, there's a, the NAM mod, or the network, what's it called? Oh, here we go. The network add-on mod controller mod. That's been continuously updated, still being updated. The latest update came out a couple days ago. There's a video on YouTube. The guy is very dedicated to his modding, which is great to see. So we've got people that have moved in here, surprisingly. Hmm. Well, it doesn't. Well, people really want services a lot, so maybe I could go, but just go some low density type of stuff along here as well. How's that zone too large? Come on. I still haven't gotten the SimCity 4 beta. Hopefully, I do get accepted to it. Obviously, that will be a dream, but. You never know. Uh, let's also build some waterfront houses. Some high density houses right up on here. So people can have a weird and wacky view of the nice ocean that we've got. Because this is going to be the ocean, isn't it? Pretty sure it is. The Atlantic Ocean. I really want to get rid of that demand. I was just, well. Commercial offices, you want a lot more commercial offices. I could probably help out a couple of these people over here with commercial offices. Do some of this. How about the commute time? Quite a bit. There we go. That should be more than enough. And uh, hopefully, the people will start working in and around here. Surprised no one's working up on over here. Probably should extend this little residential area, though. Of course, I'd much rather the uh, high density, of course. Which means more money, more tax paying citizens. And before they quickly build up over here, let's build a road over here and connect them up. That's good enough. Extend them like so. And well, we're pretty much well up. Wait it out until they build everything up here. And uh, should I should be checking out what the problem might be over here. The commute times are long. Well, I could go ahead and change that quite a bit. There's also been a couple of people. Here we go. We should read all this stuff. Power supply. Still not that, not that bad. Power, well, traffic problems. I think it's just the tickers going over these two things over and over again, really. Check it out. Yeah. Just local avenue problems. You can check out what local avenue. This one. It's still this one. Well, I could go and fix that up, though. Um, how else could I fix it? I guess the only real way is subways. Uh, they wanted a municipal airport though. I was surprised that the people would want a municipal airport. Not near as large as the international one, of course. Maybe we could build an... Like, I don't know. They complained about it. It's a little pop-up thing. Maybe I could place it next to this airport. Could get away with something cheeky like that. How is this space already occupied? The road was not getting in the way. Oh, we can see people playing a bit of ball. We don't really care about that though. This should be perfect. Alright, oh, it's that little road. 
Okay, I see. Well, let's get rid of that road first then. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, I'm making more than enough money to not worry about. Well, you know what? Let's not build that airport. Let's cancel that. Get rid of our false hopes. I really need to focus on things that we need. So what I need right now is some more subway stations. Bus Subway Avenue. Yep. Zoom all the way out. Look at our subway system. That is quite congested. But actually, blue isn't really that congested, really. Still. Okay, place something right up on there. I'm pretty sure there's lots of subways around this road, but I'll just make sure. No, not all the way down here. Surprising. Surprising indeed. Oh, hello. Well, how did that happen? It must be something to do with those subways, isn't it? It must be. Yeah, like it sort of glitches up. Alright, anyway. Let's connect the road back up then. Trying to make it at least a little bit presentable. Okay, and people are starting to move in, but at least those are businesses. But now we have to connect to those subway stations up. Which is, of course, a fun bit. I can find the subway. Okay. And connect the white dots up together. There we go, I can see a train coming in. So, got this across like so, just to speed up the uh, routes a little bit. I'll cut this in half. Okay. That should be good enough for now. Of course, in the really big sense of it, there's... Uh, of people well more than a couple of people moving in and about through the subways and of course we've got buses there well, we've got a bit of glitching this is our like our first little bit of glitching we're having some weird black stuff nice some weird tiles ah oh, okay it's all the same now, finally, we're starting to get a couple people, and they want low wealth. That's okay. Wow. That's really built up. I'm not sure why it built up so quickly. I have to place a couple of subways over there as well. Right, let's check out the power problem. It's nowhere near as bad as they make it out to be. We'll have to worry about that sooner or later, but still. There you go. Commute is short now as well. Let's also build some medium density, oh, just along this way. And I might demolish them a little bit later on. How can these people get anywhere? I've got no idea and they can't. Right. And you're still bugging me on about those damned office buildings and spaces and all that schmozzle. So we can't do anything up here. Now that is one ugly um, system. Uh, okay, I'll take it. Now everyone should be, well, maybe these guys aren't. Okay, so I'll build a couple of parks around and about fire protection spread thin not to worry not to worry at all let's see what i could build it's the basketball court here and there all right as long as the people move in now let's check out what the problems might be 
what might arise. Everything seems high over here though. So it's just a matter of playing on uh, super fast mode and watching the people move in slowly but surely. Now, of course, I got this section up over here as well. Up north, all right. Up north would be a perfect place for houses as well because it's really close to all types of jobs. There's still a demand for it. I'm surprised the RCI is just so far down. I guess it's the uh, low wealth that no one really cares about right now. So we're gonna make this uh, very demanding like make this a very demanded place we do that by placing a lot of parks around okay that's weird some massive houses popped out right away um, supposedly they can't get to a car or to a road properly there we go that fixed itself up, but let's go and just build a road. Ooh. Stop your yap and stop complaining. It can't be that bad. Whatever it is that you're talking about. Okay, this, all this is going down. Let's just make sure they are happy. School grades high, traffic's low. School grade, hospital grade, both high. Pollution low, garbage low. That is pretty much what we want. And what is it? Mayor approval and wealth. They're quite wealthy people here as well. So that's pretty useful. Lots and lots of wealthy people. We hit 401,000 people. We might not hit the 500 that I wanted first up, but we'll have to wait it out and see. I really need to fix up some of those roads though that they keep on complaining about. There's this section over here. Maybe if I connect it or make it an avenue. What about then? Hmm. Now I think here is due for a really good uh, subway. What do you guys say? So that's obviously a road. Yeah, there's nothing over here. Might as well place another one up there. There we go. Now what about over here, like a little bit more into the business or industrial area? Now, all these are streets, aren't they? Okay, place something up there. All right. Go back onto ground. Subway. So it seems like there's going to be also in SimCity 5 or the latest one, whatever you want to call it. Uh, it seems like there'll be no underground little mode. Like the water will be delivered pretty much on the surface tiles so along with the roads I'm pretty sure it is and yeah what else do you do underground subways yes there are no subway systems I'm pretty sure at least on that, that that's a bit of a blow no subway system is a really handy way of clearly mitigating all your traffic problems although well, I should be doing a little bit of a better job but it doesn't really seem to be just this area and just keep on complaining and complaining and complaining nowhere else really I'm surprised it's not even as bad over here although this was a rather poorly optimized and placed city it's yeah, just this area I really should fix that up a little how should I do that go back over here Check it out. I guess the only way is to build more of these bus subway compilations type stuff. It's, it's, oh, okay, so you can just place this stuff anywhere, can't you? Like, you're not on a road, but off road. Okay, are we connected up here? We should be. Okay, let's just make sure we are. Well, people want to move right into the subway that we just built. Got a subway. Oh, okay, it is connected quite well. Okay, also cut a line through here. Very nice. 
I don't like people complaining about healthcare. What's their problem? Where's this? Let me come up. up. No, I don't like people striking at all. Okay, so clearly you need a, another buddy to help you out over here. So that's easily done. Check out how financial situation's gone. Yep. Because we just got so many people, we are making so much more money now as well. Stop talking to me about the damn traffic. What should I get rid of? Let's just get rid of all that stuff there. Alright, that'll do. Leave it as it is. Hopefully that'll help out the striking workers. Hmm. Surprised that only this section really came out and then they left everything else. Everything here seems pretty good. Crime is medium. Traffic noise is high now. Okay, so that moved up. You can't be taught this serious about imminent power failures. Oh, we got a fire. Finally. It took us a long time to get a fire. Now, where exactly is it? Okay, it's there in that little band abandoned building. Is that demolition? Alright, that's enough. We don't want to congest the roads because supposedly it does definitely congest the roads, so. I don't want to do that. I don't want no boo-boos. The <laughs> people have got a, quite a fair ways to go. It doesn't really bother me if this actually falls down and crumbles, so. Now, where's the airplane? Clearly not the far. Oh, there it is. Maybe it is quite fast. Although, whether it will get there in on time is another matter. Okay, here's the plane. So what it's gonna do? It just flies about crazily. What the hell is it doing? Wow, you guys are ugly buildings. It's more of that damn commute time. All right, we got rid of that problem. I do not like large commute times though. Oh yes, yes, yes. I forgot. Sorry, sorry. Let's slow it down. Slow time down way quickly. All right. Wow, why did our power just go down so quickly? Is this really losing like so much efficiency or something? We're using all the power that it's got. All right, well, because we're playing on pause mode, I could build maybe another hydrogen power plant if we've got enough money, and I think we do. We definitely have enough capital, it's just whether can we can do it monthly. That's the main issue. Although, I think we should be able to do it. $10,000 a month. Easy. Too easy, in fact. Alright. Press play. Very good, very good. That should definitely give us a massive boost to our graph. Look at it. Nice. It's doubled, of course, pretty much. We've got a couple of wind powered turbines, and that's it, really. There's still massive demand for commercial business. Whoa, that's gonna be a crash. Okay, as you do. It's another crash. Let's check out a rail station. That's what I should do. It seems like there's a lot coming up from here. The question is where are the rail stations? Because they're so hard to find out where they are. At least for me, they all look so camouflaged. Must be somewhere up around here. You guys are probably screaming at me. It's like somewhere so obvious. Here we go. Freight train station. Um, actual usage is zero percent. I guess. See, what I'm doing wrong is because they're placed in the wrong type of way. Like, which way should this be facing, though, the freight train station? Is it, it's facing the car park, isn't it? Hmm. 
this one's correct, though, isn't it? Nope. Sure as hell it ain't. Alright. Clearly, I cannot do that to save my life. What is this airplane doing? I've got no idea. But with that being said, and that'll be the end of the episode. It's been a rather interesting one. We, we fell 100,000 people short of the 500, but definitely a good growing metropolis we've got growing on, on, on over here. So until next time, guys, I'll see you later. Hopefully you'll enjoy some of the new Les plays that are coming out because I sort of realized that this is fizzling out. Especially because there's, well, we've only done 22 episodes, but if you uh, realize that they're half an hour long, then that's a fair amount of time that we've been playing. So until next time, guys, I'll see you later and hopefully you have enjoyed.